a very disappointing development. Uh, I don't quite understand why the apparent need on Canada's part to cater to a, a particular political lobby in that country has resulted in their publicly putting their entire relationship with India in peril. Um, but we now must take steps to ensure that it doesn't deteriorate any further. They are an important trading partner. We have a diaspora population of 1.7 million people, 17 lakh Indians live there. Uh, and there are Indian students going there in large numbers. Now there are escalating threats against the safety and security of uh, Indians, uh, who Hindu Indians. And I think that once Canada has unleashed this, they should be very conscious of the dangers they're provoking, including, frankly, for um, importing a kind of extremism that doesn't exist in India anymore in Punjab into their country instead, which is very, very unfortunate. So I would urge the Canadians uh, to also take a deep breath and rethink what they're doing. 